I'm Rajiv Desi and I'm the International Recruitment Officer at South Bellman College. I'm just going to take a few minutes to speak to you very briefly about the point-based system and how it will affect student entry into the UK. The point-based system is a new system put in place by the UK Board Agency that dictates where students can now enter the UK. There are five tiers and tier four is the one that concerns student entry. Students now have to apply online and need to score 40 points on the application for them to enter the UK. You will get 30 points for applying to a course at an acceptable level and you will need an approved education provider like South Birmingham College to act as a sponsor. Uh, we recently got inspected by the UK Board Agency and have now been given a license, uh, a Grade A license to uh, sponsor international students. We are one of the first colleges to get this license. The remaining 10 points that we will need uh, concern your financial status. You will need to show that you have the four course fees and living costs up to £600 a month uh, and this will have to be either in your own bank account or in a joint account with your parents. If you get the full 40 points, then you can apply to South Birmingham College. South Birmingham College will for the time being continue to offer unconditional letters. However, when the UK Board Agency puts a management system into play, we will then be offering CASs and electronic reference numbers, which will help you in getting your student visa. The money you need to show now covers your course fees for the first year and standard living costs for up to, the, for up to a maximum of nine months. Uh, and you now need to show £600 a month for standard living costs. The money will now need to be either in your name or in a joint account with your sponsor. If a student is caught providing false information on the online application form, they will be stopped from entering the UK for up to 10 years, either as a student or as a visitor. So please be very careful and do not provide false information when filling in the application form. With the point-based system, students now will have to apply for courses that are either level 3 or above. You can still apply to do an arts course. Even though this isn't at level 3, you will still need to apply for a student visa to do a one-year English course. It's very important for students to know that when they arrive, if there's, are, if there's any problems regarding attendance or payment fees, South Birmingham College will have to let the UK Board Agency know straight away. On top of that, if there's any changes in your home address or if you are in employment, you need to let the college know straight away as all this information will need to be passed on to the UK Board Agency. Regarding attendance, if a student is to miss 10 sessions, for example, if they miss 10 lessons or are continuously late, it is our duty as a college to let the UK Board, in, UK board Agency know. With the point-based system, the onus is now on the student to let the college know when A, they get their visa, and B, when they arrive in the UK. Once a student arrives, if they fail to start the course within 10 days, again, South Birmingham College will have to let the UK Board Agency know. Another major change with the point-based system is that now students cannot apply to more than one college without getting another CAS. Students can also apply for a student visa visa if they want to apply for a short course, for example, the English Summer School. Please visit the UK Board Agency website for more in-depth information concerning the point-based system.